Lord, and lead me in the plain path, in the straight path, the narrow path, because of my enemies. That's also prophetic. Uh, Jesus mentions this. Uh, also, <laughs> let's continue. Deliver me not over... Uh, deliver me not over unto the will of my enemies. For false witnesses have risen up against me and such as breathe out cruelty. This is really something Jesus could have said. Uh, you know, because this is what happened to him. There were a lot of false witnesses and they were threatening him. They were hitting him. They were striking him. They were pulling his beard. They were punching him. And maybe, you know, I could see him praying this. You know, deliver me not to the will of my enemies. I put, I put my, um, I surrender to your will and let your will be done. Not their will be done be done <laughs> okay uh, I had fainted uh, oh deliver me not unto the will of the enemies for false witnesses have risen up against me such as breathe out cruelty I had fainted unless I had be believed to see the goodness of the Lord in the in the land of the living because God had intervened in his situation and helped him to see the good way the right way the and to see that there was hope in this world not just uh, seeing a bunch of lost people but see that there was hope Okay, wait on the Lord and be of good courage, and he shall strengthen your heart. I say, wait on the Lord. Yes, this is the answer to David's prayer, that he would wait on the Lord, that his waiting on the Lord brings out his courage, that his waiting on the Lord brings out strengthening his his uh his his spirit okay i say on the lord <laughs> wait on the lord okay guys oh man this is a long one uh have a good day